Hello there, YouTubers. Um, a lot of you know me as Lady Silver Vixen, and then there are some of you who know me as uh, the Dark Moon Midnight, which is the screen name that I have chosen to go by here on YouTube. Um, recently I was on uh, YouTube here, skimming through and looking for interesting videos just to kind of sit and watch like a lot of us do. And I came across one of, one of my favorite people in the world, and that's Penn, and his companion, Teller. They do a, um, a series called Bullshit. Um, the in particular video that I was watching was called Penn and Teller's The Bible is Bullshit. Okay, you can find that in my favorites, and I'll also be adding a link to the side of this. However, the main reason why I'm creating this video is because of a comment that was left. And I'm not causing any drama or anything else, but because of this comment is the reason why I'm making this video. <clears throat> 13 hours ago, mind you this is 10.59 a.m. Eastern Time, 13 hours ago, um, Mom Sido posted this comment in response to one of mine. I'm going to read you my comment, then I'm going to read you his, hers, whoever it. This is what I said. I said, it's a shame people have to fight and argue over religion. All religions are based on some sort of faith, and each of them have some sort of fallacy. Wicca, for instance, which is what I practice, spells don't always work. Christianity has legitimate time flaws, so who cares? Freedom of religion means freedom to choose which religion is best for you. Blessings from the goddess be with you all. Now, Monsetto responded to this by stating, The dark moon, and doesn't finish my name, which is automatically an insult. And then asked me, Wicca? With a question mark? You're a warlock or a witch. Doesn't really matter. You belong to a cult. And an evil one at that. Geez, now we have freaks coming out of the woodwork. Oh dear, please don't cast a spell on me. For starters, for those of you who don't know what Wicca is, you can watch a lot of my videos. I actually have a video that I'm going to link to this one um, called What is Wicca? Um, I would like to make a few clarifications here. Okay? Wicca, for one, is a nature-based religion, okay, and as such, the first law is, and it harm none, do what thou will, okay, it means you cannot harm somebody physically, mentally, emotionally, or harm them in any way, shape, or form, and <clears throat> when it comes to spell working, you cannot cast a spell on somebody without their permission, otherwise the karmatic retribution will actually uh, do more damage than it will do good. So, I don't cast spells on people unless I have their permission. That's for starters, okay? And I do not cast spells on people, not just because I need their permission, but because I find that without their permission, it is rude, it goes against their free will. And in the end, I can end up harming somebody by doing so, and I refuse to do that. Now, <clears throat> I've also had a comment posted on my page before. Some of you saw it, some of you didn't. Um, it was posted by a gentleman called Paul the Christians. He is no longer on YouTube, as far as I know. Um, he told me that the screenings of pagans are dark. The Dark Moon Midnight is not a dark name. Just because it has the word dark in it does not make it a dark name. I'm going to explain this to you. The Dark Moon, which in and of itself is pretty obvious. It is the time of the moon cycle where you cannot see it. At this time, it is a great time for a free-flowing creativity, and that is why I like it so much. I'm 
on the side as a hobby. I'm a short story writer, and you know, with these videos, I have to pre plan most of them. This one here, unfortunately, was not pre planned, so bear with me. But midnight happens to be my favorite time of night. And the reason why it is my favorite time of night is because, the for the most part, the collective consciousness is actually sleeping at this point, and it allows for clear thinking. You don't have to listen to the psychic static in your head all day, and particularly at midnight. Um, and for those of you who have always been wondering about why I call myself Lady Silver Vixen, I'm going to explain this one to you too, and there's nothing dark about this. Lady Silver Vixen was actually originally Silver Vixen, which was given to me by a coven that I used to run. The coven's name was the Coven of Silence. We followed the creed to know, to dare, and to be silent. And <clears throat> in the process, I was currently at that time searching for my magical name. And a magical name is a name that we go by, or some of us go by, um, that allow us to shift. It is an aid to help us shift into a higher consciousness. Um, Silver Vixen was given to me because I cannot wear any other jewelry besides silver colored jewelry. I wear stainless steel, pewter, and silver. Those are the only three things that I can actually wear that I do not have an allergic reaction to. Um, the other thing, Vixen. No, a Vixen is not some hot chick that walks down the street wearing a pair of booty shorts and a halter top. Okay, a vixen is a female fox, and a lot of you know what a fox stands for. Sly, cunning, intuitive, graceful. I mean, there's a lot of different words that describe the fox, and I, I fit a lot of those terms. Um, lady wasn't added on until I turned 18. I'm currently 20 years old. Um, the only reason why Lady ever came on the, to the name Silver Vixen to begin with was because I was no longer a child. I am now an adult, and my name should portray such, and I should get the amount of respect that being an adult comes, uh, has that come with it. And it's really sad that we have to argue over religion and poke and prod at each other. I hate poking and prodding. I really do. Now, if you would like a peaceful debate, I will more than gladly give you one. But, until then, I guess we're all going to be aliens poking and prodding at each other. But that's all that I had to say for this one. I hope you all enjoy this video. Check out the links on the side. That side, that side, whatever. They're, they're somewhere. Y'all have a good one. Lady Silver Vixen signing out.